going on guys it's fresco here and today we are back with another episode of the Yu-Gi-Oh! progression series first episode of season three here we are with the duel list alliance i had stuff i wanted to say but i don't remember what i was gonna say so that's fun every time every single time well uh cards in this set like i said i wanted to start uh, doing some research into the sets instead of going in i was like i have no idea what's in this set but i don't I do know. I do know. And we we got some Yangzings. We got Shadals. Fun. Uh, Lancia debuts in this set. So I'm trying to, I'm hoping to pull all of that. Of course, everything would be fantastic. I would love to pull a Shadal package now that the Black Wings are gone. But I have other plans in case we don't. Honestly, I don't know what I'm going to play today. But we're going to find out together. Duelist Alliance. 24 packs. Here we come. Alright, let me just... Boop. Okay. Duelist Alliance, 24 packs. Deskbot, 001. And alright, starting off well with the Satellar Knight Den... Den... Deneb? Shadal Falco? And Deskbot, 001. So that's a fantastic first pack. Okay, I guess this is just where we are at default. Lancia! We pulled Lancia. And Falco... Cult's Cannon. Not what I want to see in, from the Super Rare slot. I'm looking for Shadal Fusion, so if you could just go away, that would be lovely. Uh, Shadal Hedgehog. So, from this set, oh, we got Seer. Oh, Burning Abyss, I think, is also... I think Burning Abyss debuted in this set. So maybe we can pull a good Burning Abyss package. Shadal Dragon, that's fun. Another Super Rare. This is not... The set that started off the whole hollow thing, right? I'm pretty sure that was Breakers of Shadow. Because that's the whole pre-2016 thing, or post-2016 thing on the in that sorting these packs. I, I'm pretty sure. Nine Vault. Batterman Nine Vault. After adding all those all the cards to the uh card maker. That's not the right word. Uh online pro the online thing. Why am I a uh, collection? Online connection. After all, adding all the cards that we pulled to the online collection, I actually have a pretty sick Battery Man package. So I might have to play that. Uh, another Lancia, so that's fantastic. Uh, more Yang Zings in the Ultra Rare slot. Oh my god. No. No Shadals in this, in this pack, which is kind of sad. Battery Man 9 Volt, another uh, thing. Next pack we have, and okay, the first pack without a hollow, and that's fine because we got double squamata. <laughs> okay, that fair, fair enough. Uh, there's another nine volt. Um, but other than that, nothing, nothing in this pack. Dark, no, uh, another nine volt. Monarch Stormforth. This is a fantastic card if we want to play Hazy Flame, but I don't know if I have a good enough Hazy Flame package. I'd have to look into that. Next, <laughs> there is the Shadal Core, though I would like to get an actual core and pull Shadal Fusion and Winda or Construct. Please. Please. Skarm. More Burning Abyss support. Other than that, nothing really in this pack. Are we going to play Satellar Knights? <laughs> we pulled Deltaros. Oh, God. I think I'm pretty sure Deltaros is nuts, isn't he? Before wants to. Oh, he's, he's generic. Okay, well, this. When this card has exceeded material, your opponent cannot activate cards or effects when you normal or special summon a monster. Just once per turn, you can detach one exceeds material from this card, then target one face-up card on the field, destroy it. If this card soft one per turn, if this card is sent from the field to the graveyard, you can special summon one Teller Knight monster from your hand or deck. Okay. So as a generic card, he is nuts. As a Satellar Knight card, 
in a in a in a Teller Knight deck, even more nuts. I'm actually kind of glad I pulled him. <laughs> so yeah, he's gonna be great. Uh, three 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 materials is a little little steep, but we can work with it. Pilgrim Reaper. I'll have to look into Pilgrim Reaper uh, for one of the way uh, directions I'm going. Another ninth vault. I think we have a play set of nine vault. There's Panzer Dragon. Another Satella Knight. White Prince. Um, Monarch Stormforth. Panzer Dragon. Classic Insta Fusion target. Nope. Oh, Cloud Castle. Sh Hedgehog. You got Hedgehog. Uh, more more Burning Abyss stuff. I think all the Burning Abyss. It, Burning Abyss monsters come in rare except for Dante, which is a super secret. One of the two. Might be altered. He's a hollow. And the secret that we pull is Ryza the Mega Monarch. Um, we don't have Ryza. And two tributes is a little steep, if you ask me. Uh, when you uh, if this card is tribute summoned, target one card on the field and one card on either player's graveyard. Also, if this card was tribute summoned by tributing a wood monster, you can target an additional card on the field. Place the first target on the top of the deck in any order. Sorry. Rise of the Man of Monarch. Not awful, but, I mean, I'm not, you know, super excited. The Dragonhorn Hunter. Another Pendulum. We have not been getting many pendulums in this set. Okay, this pack, we got one dragon and one squamata. I think that is definitely our play set of squamata. But again, none of the Shadow fusions or the fusion spell. None of the monsters or the spell. Which is really, you know, kicking us down. Ve I actually think our th third copy of Vega. And then another Satellar Knight in the hollow slot. So maybe Satellar Knight's... We ha we got something for Satellar Knights. I think I'm saying that right. Uh, another Panzer Dragon. So really in that s that pack and this pack and Stormforth Squamata, which is not one we want to see anymore. Nothing really to of wor noteworthy in that in that set. Another super rare. Oh my God. Yang Zing again. Um, but again, nothing nothing really of note. Other than we got a super rare that isn't very useful. Okay, so Telenite Skybridge, I'll have to keep that in mind. Uh, I don't know if we got any more of those. I haven't been paying too much attention. Oh my god. Oh my god. I think they're warriors too, so we can play Excalibur. We can play Heroic Champion Excalibur. We can play Blade Armor Ninja. We did. I, did, I, I mean, I don't see another way to go. I, I mean, yeah. And, okay, final pack wasn't awful. Uh, we got, I think that's our third Storm, fourth might be our fourth. We've got plenty of Lancia and Vega. We've got all the Vega. But yeah, all in all, not we did not pull what we wanted to pull, but we pulled Nutty. So, I'm going to say that I'm happy. I'm happy with, with what we pulled. Um, I'm going to go... Put a deck together, or maybe several decks. I don't know. Uh, I'm just gonna have fun uh, brewing in what deck to bring to today's match. Yeah, I'll see y'all here with the deck profile. Alrighty, here we are back for the deck profile. And if you haven't already guessed it, we are playing Black Wings. They've been working out really well in the past, and I don't see a reason to stop until they start to lose. So let's head it, hop right into this deck profile. You've seen it once, you've seen it a thousand times. We've got one, Blackwing Blizzard of the Far North, then two, three, Blackwing Boar of the Spear, and... Um... Uh... Hello? W what do you mean I said I wouldn't? But... But it's not legally binding. What? Well, I know that... They'll be disappointed, but it's, it's, I mean, it's winning. They understand. What? I mean, I don't know. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, okay. Alright, fine. I'll play something else. Alright, guys. Um.
little little skit there for a second. I'm not actually playing Black Wings because that would be stupid and going back on what I said would be happening. Um, I just wanted to do a little little skit because I thought it would be fun. Um, and to give the deck one final send off. You have served us well, and it is I I'm sad to see you go, but. All eras must come to an end. All right. So here is the actual deck we are playing, and if you can't see, and and if you, as you can see. Those are the words. We are playing Battery Man. This is gonna be fun. Um, I was looking through all the decks that I had access to, uh, going through the the three main ones that I could four 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 bet decks I could fully build are Piratic, Bujin, kind of, Medolce, kind of. And Battery Man. And on all honestly, after looking at them all, building them all, I feel like the two best ones out of those four? Paratic and Battery Man. Except Paratic, all those normal monsters that it needs to play, it's, they don't do anything when they get in your hand and they brick up the deck and I just don't like how that flows. So I'm going to go with Battery Man. Because it's actually kind of nuts and we pulled a pretty good package. As you can see, we pulled... We've got three Battery Man 9 Volt, three Battery Man AAA, three Battery Man Charger, one Battery Man Fuel Cell, two Battery Man Industrial Strength, three Battery Man Micro Cell, one Ma Hunter, one Sis Hunter, and one Thunder Sea Horse. That is it for the monster lineup. To give a little overview of the monster lineup, we've got the three Battery Man 9 the, the Battery Man 9 Volt that Special that summons itself and then adds a battery man from deck to hand and then doubles its attack and defense, but it's destroyed during the end phase. We've got D Battery Man Triple A, which when normal summoned or flipped face up, I can special summon a triple A from my hand or graveyard. Then we've got Charger, who I can uh when who a uh, special summons a battery man except for Charger from my hand or deck uh on summon. And then he gains three hundred attack for every battery for every thunder type monster I control. We've got fuel cell, which uh, if I control two or more face-up battery man monsters, I can special summon this card from my hand, so he's his free special summon, but he's also a, tr uh, a one monster tribute that I can use Monarch Stormforth on, which you can see is in the deck further in the deck profile. And then it allows me to tribute a battery man monster, except for itself, to select the card my opponent controls and bounce it to the hand. Uh, free compulse. Not free. Uh, I have to tribute a battery man. Um, next we have the two battery man industrial strength, which I can... Special summon it by removing from play two battery man monsters. And once per turn, I can remove from play one thunder type monster from my graveyard to destroy one monster and one spell slash trap card on the field. That's nutty. Uh, then we have the three battery man micro cell, which adds a battery man from deck to hand, a level four or lower battery man from deck to hand, so either either nine volt or triple A. And then when it's destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, I get to draw a card. Then we have Ma Hunter, which special, which allows me to have an extra normal summon when if it's a level four light thunder type monster, uh, except for Ma Hunter. Uh, then we have Sis Hunter, who, when it when it's summoned, I can uh, target a level four light thunder type monster with 1600 or less attack in my graveyard, except for Sis Hunter, banish the target during the end phase, add it to my hand. So I banish it during my turn, and then at the end of the turn, it comes to my hand. Why they decide? I guess that was so you couldn't use it during the turn you summon Sis Hunter, which I mean, fair like could enable some pretty like like for Thunder Seahorse in Thunder Seahorse's case, I could use Thunder Seahorse, grab two things, summon Sis Hunter, grab su Thunder Seahorse back, use it again, grab uh grab two more. I mean, I'm already locked out of special summoning, so Thunder Seahorse I can discard it and then add two level four light Thunder type monsters with the same name with 1600 or less attack from my deck. And add it to my hand, and then I can't special summon for the rest of the turn. Except it's a hard once per turn. So what I said earlier with Sis Hunter, if Sis Hunter just added directly to hand instead of banishing, couldn't happen. 
is not a situation that could happen because it's a hard one to return, which I did not read. <laughs> battery charger. Pay 500 life points special summon a battery man monster. A battery man monster from my graveyard. It's monster reborn for battery man, but I pay 500 life points. I I think it's pretty good. And we've got the one book of moon, the one cold wave, the one dark hole, the one pot of avarice, the one rank up magic numeron force, which I will explain more of as to why I'm playing. Well. The reason I'm playing Rank of Magic Numeron Force is because I think it would be hilarious if we pulled this off. That is the only reason. That and the, the plays I can do with it are kind of cool. They do something. Kind of. Uh, but more on that when I get to the extra deck. Then we are playing the two Recycling Batteries, which allow me to add two Thunder-type monsters with 1,500 or less attack from my graveyard to my hand. Uh, th uh, there was another card. I can't remember what it was called. Uh, that was specifically level 4 or lower battery men, I think. And I, so I was looking at, you know, the level 4 or lower battery men that I have. Well, they're all, you know, 1,500 or less. And these guys are 1,500 or less, so that just gives me more targets. It did. It does the exact same thing. It changes what I can add. It just adds two thunder type with 1,500 or less attack in my graveyard to my hand instead of two battery men, level four level over battery men. So in my opinion, better card. Only the difference is the other one is a quick play and this one is not, though I don't know why that would be necessary. Next up we have three the Monarch Stormforth, with this is no soul exchange. This basically allows us to tribute one of uh Sea Dog's uh, mo uh, monsters for either charger or fuel cell. Then we have double up start goblin. Then we have bottomless Fiendish, Imperial Order, Karma Cut, and Triple Phoenix Wing when blasts. For the extra deck, we'll do the extra deck first. It's just a the extra deck is just a toolbox of rank four monsters. And so, uh, well, rank four, and I've got like three rank fives in there because I have multiple charge chargers, and charger makes rank five monster. Well, the one one rank five monster, the other two are targets for Numeron. Uh, so first, we're playing Double Gaga Giga the Risen. Uh, as you can see, he has no effect. He's essentially just a big beater. If I need something that big, which I don't think, I don't think I'll ever go into him, but I don't have anything better to play that I can summon. And we have double Star Seraph Sentry, number 102. Um, like I said, this is just a toolbox of various effects that could come up at some point, but I mean, I have the few monsters that I'll probably be going into the most. And this is probably not one of them, because I don't see myself, you know, I have six, and I don't, well, six, eight, nine. And so, you know, he requires a third of them. And I don't see that happening too often. Um, though, if I could, he's not awful, because he has the attack of my opponent's monsters. I really should have read these guys before I studied the deck profile. Burner Visor, I have, he uh, can... He's basically a union monster, except he doesn't read union, because he has the effect that allows him to attach him, like attach himself to as an equip card to a monster you control and detach and special summon himself. Um, and the monster that is equipped with him can attack directly. Uh, and then when it inflicts damage, I can discard a, t a card to inflict 500 point more points of damage to my opponent. Then we have... Number 69, the Heraldic, Heraldic Crest. Uh, when special summoned, I negate the effects of all other Xyz monsters my opponent controls, and I can detach a material to target one, one other face-up Xyz monster on the field, and then Heraldic Crest becomes, name becomes that Xyz monster, and this effect, and that effect becomes that Xyz monster's effect for the rest of the turn. Rhapsody and Berserk is half of a Union monster because he can, he can equip himself, but he can't unequip himself. Um, and then the equip monster gains 1,200 attack, which is how much defense he has. And then I up to twice per turn, so both materials, which I would probably do before I equip him to anything, is I can discard. Uh, I can use one material to banish a card from my opponent's graveyard up to twice per turn. He has two materials. I would do that and then attach him to a monster because, I mean, at that point, he's a, mo a monster with no effect that is zero attack and 1,200 defense. Uh, we'll come back to these two later. Next up, we have Photon Papiloperative. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, 
self-explanatory changes the monster from defense to attack the monster loses 600 if i need to get over a wall that he's put up that's pretty good so tell all right delta Rose, three out of four three level four monsters again that's half that's a third of it but he's much better in my opinion payoff than 102 uh couldn't find a home for him in teller knights because i did not pull enough teller knight monsters i had like eight six i had six monsters and three spells and that was it from that archetype um but he's still nuts even without his effect to summon a teller knight from deck uh, because uh my opponent cannot uh when this card has expertise material my opponent Cannot activate cards or effects when I normal special summon monsters and once per turn I can detach and exceed material to target it on the field and destroy it. And then went up Zen, Zen Master Meister. He flips my monsters face down, so he could be, and then flips them back face up, so he could be super useful in loops with microcell. So say I somehow get, I get microcell on the field, so microcell's on the field face down, and Zen Meister is. Uh, on the field face up and Connor doesn't have a thing to anything to summon and so in the next turn I flip up uh, Microcell Gets effect activates Zen Meister's effect flips Microcell back face down during the end of the end turn end of the turn Microcell flips back face up and I get his effect again Nutty Yeah, that is the deck profile the new deck profile uh, This is a lot longer than all the other all the other ones because one this is a deck that we've never played before and i really wanted to go into depth of why i'm playing the cards i'm playing some of these self-explanatory because i played them before others new brand new wanted to explain uh oh you know what i didn't explain i forgot to explain uh utopia ray and crest of horror crest of horror i will most likely go into typically win for all the crest so numero force does not require that you have the uh that you have uh, so like for C69, Numeron does not require that I have 69 under him, just that I have a light monster that is rank 4. And in that, to that effect, I have Star Seraph, 69, Photon Papillary Operative, and Delta Rose. Uh, and that's for both 69 and 39, uh, C60, C69 and C39. Um, C39, I mean... He's better if I had Utopia under him. I don't have Utopia. But he can still prevent uh, Sea Dog from using spells and traps during the damage step. And then we have C69, which, you know, when my opponent attacks, all cards they just they control are destroyed. So, you know, he's not going to want to attack him. He's got 4,000 attack, and if C69, or if 69 is his... Is under him as material, and we have 69. We're playing him. I can once per turn detach a material from this card, and then target exceeds monster my opponent controls. The same effect as as 69, where he's his name changes and he gains that monster's effect, but also also he gains that monster's attack. So he jumps from so say uh he had uh 103 because I don't know if he pulled 103, but that's a card that. C uh, Simo and Nim Nim seem to love Ragnar Zero. He would one gain 2400 attack bump, bumping him up to 64, and then name would change to 103, and then he would gain this effect. So you know, kind of nutty in my opinion, especially in the sealed kind of format. So yeah, I guess better better thing is one I know he has Tiger King, Tiger King. So we would gain 2,200 attack and gain Tiger King's effect and and his name. So he would be then affected by the by the fire the fire formation spells and traps, which is again nutty. So yeah, that's the deck profile. I hope you all like it, and I hope you're ready because let's because we're gonna hop right into this duel. Let's go duel with Alliance Era. <laughs> yeah, let's go duel with Alliance Era. Okay. Uh, let's play rock, paper, scissors. Um, let's play rock, paper, scissors. Oh, I totally thought of a different card. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, well, if I lose, it's because I didn't put this card in. Oh, mm. oh, <laughs> okay. You won. Um, yeah. See, this is the thing. I didn't think about 
what my deck wants to do if it wants to go first or second. You know, um, I didn't so even think about first. certain cards. Okay. So I'm going first. Okay. This, <laughs> this is a hash. This, this oh is no. Bad. Oh <laughs> this no. Hand this is, is terrible. This is very that much is a go terrible. second hand. Uh, stand by. May? Yeah, you're good. You're good. Huh. I. <laughs> okay. mm. I don't know what you're trying to do with your deck, then. I'm. I'm just gonna, gonna do my extra deck real quick and just look at zones. look at one of the best cards I pulled. Yeah. Oh yeah, we gotta make sure that we, we choose, choose the zones. zones. I mean, it doesn't matter too I'm much in this format because it doesn't pass pass exist turn. yet. Yeah, but I still like that's, to choose where I am. That's I a card. Cards. Um, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna set three cards. Oh, fun! Oh, he set a monster race down. Last okay. turn. This doesn't tell you anything. For all you know, it could be a dupe frog. Yeah. Mm. For all you know, I pulled a phenomenal water package and decided to play some water, some frog arcs, even without treeborn frog. All right. Well, then we're going to. We're going to activate the Monarch's Stormforth. Oh, fuck. Stormforth good? Stormforth is indeed good, Ben. Cool. Then I'm going to tribute your monster for yeah, Battery that's... Man Charger. Yeah. Charges yeah, of... you can also catch that bottomless. Oh. Okay. Okay, so you are on Shadal's, and I nope, he's banished. Let me. He is just, banished. That's not. That's the wrong thing. Not the hand. God damn it. Unfortunately, banished. dragon does not trigger. Yeah. Yeah. No, he doesn't because he wasn't flip face up. I don't think Charger triggers either because he's mm -hmm. no longer on the field. Nope. Which is unfortunate, and that's my normal summon for the turn. So I guess I'm just yeah. gonna pass again. Um. Go. <laughs> cool. Draw for turn. Go. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I I now really wish I had pulled the yeah. other. Stand by me. I I know. Okay, so we're on Shadals. I need to read. Uh, I need to read Dragon first. Okay. Uh. Dragon does absolutely not. He's okay. He can pulse. Okay, and he's not sent to the graveyard by card effect, which is why he nope. didn't trigger. Correct. Yep. Correct. Okay. Well, I'm gonna set a card. And on the battery man, I'm gonna pass really? turn. I'm gonna activate upstart. Yeah, you would. That is something you would do. <laughs> hey, hey, it's not a, hey, it's not a progression series video without an upstart goblin. Let's not lie. It's yeah, you're not. Wrong. Unfortunately, I think that's about it. <laughs> we are uh, just both breaking. Okay, stand by. I, yeah. Main. Yeah. Set. Pass your go. <laughs> um, I don't want this in my hand. I I don't want this in my hand. I'm I'm gonna normal summon Shadal Hedgehog. <laughs> normal summon Hedgehog. Oh damn. Okay. Uh, battle phase. <laughs> Yeah. Eight? <laughs> I'll take the eight. Okay. Uh, pass? Okay, drawing. Please, please, just give me something I can use. Stand by. Main. Yeah, yeah. Set. Pass. Oh my god, what the fuck are we playing? Not, not fun. <laughs> we're I'm, I'm we're gonna... playing Brick. I'm gonna tribute set a monster and pass. Mm, that's fun. Draw for turn. No, no, they do not what I want to see. <sighs> okay. I need to do something, and. Except I don't want to do something. So Summon that 9 volt. Summon 9 volt. Because I know you probably pulled a place out of it. This is the reason you're playing this damn deck. 
you know, I'm not going to lie to you. I did pull a playset. I am playing the full three, and I have not I have not drawn him. He is still in my what deck. What the fuck? <laughs> what is this damn duel? And turn. I'm breaking. I'm, I'm done. I don't know what you're talking about. I am breaking. Go for turn. Hard. Out of green. You would. <laughs> you would. Off, off the top. We're going to set one. We're going to flip summon shit all beast. Um. Draw two cards and then discard. Oh, and now you get another two cards. Fine. Go ahead. Do it. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna discard we're gonna discard Jane. Okay. We're gonna activate Upstart Goblin. <laughs> yeah. Why did we discard? Oh, right, because you. Sorry, yeah, I have to discard one. Yeah, I forgot. A normal summon dragon. So you're playing a similar deck to what Simo played. Battle phase attack uh, for twenty two. I am going to. I'm going to wing blast targeting beast pitching, triple A for cost. Okay. I'm gonna attack for nineteen. I am going to activate... Don't tell me you have a second fucking Wing Blast. No, I'm going to activate Karma Cut, targeting Dragon okay. Pitching... Uh... Pitching... And it's all uh, copies charger. from the graveyard, yeah, too. Yeah, and then all okay. copies from the graveyard. Pitching Charger. What in the fuck is this? Go! Draw for what turn. What did we get? That is not the card I wanted to see. Uh, standby. Standby. Main. Yeah. Uh, banish triple A. Banish charger. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh Special shit! Industrial strength. Oh shit! Hold on. Wait. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh no. No. This can catch the fucking breakthrough. That can catch breakthrough. <laughs> How? Uh, I know. Uh. That doesn't stop his summon, right? It doesn't stop the summon, no. Well, I, but I mean, it stops I can use his effect right now, this turn anyway, because I have no Thunders oh. in Grave. Oh. oh no, I'm stupid. <laughs> Fuck! I have no Thunders it's okay. in Grave. I couldn't do it's anything okay. with him anyway. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> I have a place out of it. I could, I could use others. <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna do a we're battle phase 26. and punch for 26. Main phase <laughs> 2. I'm gonna pass turn. How does this work? I'm gonna activate Preem. Um, special summon the Hedgehog. Okay, you have special summon the Hedgehog. What is going on? I don't know how I'm gonna beat this thing. Why would you special summon? Oh, you special summon the because you don't have Beast and Grave, right? I forgot about that. Activate your all fusion. You fucking have the fusion. You pull the fusion. I the fucking. Okay, hold send, on. Send Dragon or send Beast and uh, Hedgehog to Grave. Yeah. It's so stupid, because it doesn't have enough attack. Special summon window? Oh. <laughs> um. Beast, Beast Chain Link 1, Hedgehog, or, yeah. Beast Chain Link 1, Hedgehog Chain Link 2. Uh. Yeah, go ahead. Add Squamata to hand? Yeah. Beast, beast. Draw a card off a beast? Yeah. Is that a card face down? Yeah. How do I out this? I still don't know how I fucking out this. I, I need a top deck. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> I need a top deck. End turn? Okay. Draw for turn. That is card. Now, unfortunately, Ben, I don't have Construct. Hmm. See, this is a card. It depends on how I want to do this. Um, oh, whatever. You have industrial strength. You don't even care. Oh, right. This prime is gone. Right, yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm going to normal summon 9 volt. Oh. Trigger 9 volt? No. Uh, thinking. Hold on. 
Reynolds Carter's son, you can have one better than Reynolds to protect your, your hand, and if you do, it's attack, it's attack and defense become doubled. And then it's destroyed during the end phase. Oh, I, I know. I throw it off for the fucking deck! I can't have that happen! Breakthrough skill okay, targeting so 9 volts! Okay, so he is not destroyed during the end phase, or is he? I don't know how that works. Uh, he's not. I don't think he's destroyed. Okay. Well, fine. I won't, you know, get the search, but I am going to uh, special summon fuel cell. Because oh, fuck. I have two battery mans. No! <laughs> yeah. He's, he's still at a thousand, but that is enough to go to battle phase and punch into Winda. Yep. Effects then, of Winda oh. to add the fucking shit all uh, fusion well, to hand. Card is oh, yep, okay. Uh, fuel cell is then going to attack your face down. Yeah, Skolmata's effect is going to destroy your uh, industrial strength. Oh, wait. No, never mind. It's not going to activate. Oh, wait, no, yeah, the flip yeah, effect's going to yeah, activate. Flip, yep, flip the, flip act activate. the flip activates. Um, it's the uh, second effect that doesn't activate. Turn, you can remove. Uh, it, does say, it does say it's just as one monster. Okay. Okay. So destroy that. I um, saved myself a shit ton of power. I saved myself from a shit ton of damage. This right. needs to be one hell of a fucking top deck. I'm going to go to the end phase and make a cut here. So we're back. And we believe, even though it's the first we one we hit it, he's, he's still destroyed. Yep. So we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna let that happen. Um, if we're wrong, if we're wrong, somebody will call us out. Because we know, we know you will anyway. Yep. <laughs> um, no way. And that's where we pass turn. That is a card that I do not want to see. I'm gonna... I'm gonna sell him fast, fuck. <laughs> Alright, draw for turn. Yep. Damn, that's unfortunate. Okay. But this just has been summoned. Okay, so standby, main. Yep, yep. I'm going to activate Battery Charger. By paying 500 life points, I can special summon a Battery Man from my graveyard. Not a card I wanted you to see! So we're going to special summon 9 Volt, and we're going to trigger 9 Volt's effect. I have nothing to stop 9 Volt. Yeah. Okay. Um... So it's a, it is a hard once per turn, so I won't be grabbing another nine volt. Uh, it is a bad. Oh, it is a hard. So you're I, gonna grab the cell. I could. I'm I'm surprised I haven't seen a cell dropped yet. I could grab the micro cell. Uh. So here's the thing. I didn't realize this until way later. I don't actually have a fuel cell, and that's why I decided not to, get to play. Not to play. Oh, I only have battery. one fuel cell. I I decided not to play it simply because I don't have a fuel cell, but also because I pulled Winda and Fusion, and I was not oh. expecting you to go this route. Uh, man, maybe I do grab. Uh, nine volt. No, because I don't want to. It this wouldn't do anything. Tricky. All it would be was extra damage. It's at 2,000. It will be you at 2,000. This might not be the right move, but we're going to go for it. I'm going to grab uh, Battery Man AAA. Interesting. That was the wrong move. That was the wrong decision. I um, mean, my hand's kind of clogged right now, man. Um... Yeah, that was the wrong decision. Um, but we're living with it, so... I don't want that to happen, so I guess this is happening. Um, we're going to normal summon AAA. Its effect won't activate because I don't have a target for it. Yep. Uh, we're going to overlay 
AAA and 9 volt? No, you did not. Into... You did not. You did not pull Castell. No, I didn't. Uh, into Papli op pap pap pill operative. Papi operative. Pap pap pill operative. I think. Pap pill operative. Yeah. Um. We're then going to activate its effect. Might as well get it out of the way. We're gonna detach the triple A. All right. And so unfortunately, it's I don't have a target. It's, it's, oh, okay. I can um, deal with the deck, and that's about it. So yeah. I'm literally viewing it to shuffle. Okay, and then it loses 600 attack, so it's down to 200. Yep. We go to battle phase. We're going to have fuel cell punch into... So that's 19? Yes. And then attack directly for 21. 21. Yeah, that was... That was a misplay. I, I, it was a misplay because I had game. If I did, then that was a huge I, misplay. That was a huge, huge fucking misplay. If I during my main phase one, activate cold wave. Um. Hmm. Let me think. You have order. Well, if I had order, I wouldn't be thinking. Did he pull two window? He did not pull two window. It wouldn't matter. I couldn't activate another Shadal Fusion anyway. Oh, you're right. So what do you do? What did you possibly do here? Okay. Cold Wave is good. What do you? What do you I'm gonna banish. Do here. I'm going to banish a light. And a dark. Oh, you are not fucking playing this card. I am playing Bo Black Luster Soldier. <laughs> you are not fucking Jenny. playing this card. I'm playing Black Luster Soldier. How am I not playing Black Luster Soldier? Ben, tell me why I wouldn't <laughs> be playing this damn card right now. No, that's not okay. You're not allowed to play this card, but... Battle phase! Attack! <laughs> yeah, okay, I'll take the 900. Yeah, you're taking another 900, pal. Yep. yep. Dude, the top deck of the century. Yep. <laughs> uh, end and turn. It's... Until and your next turn. Okay, so yep. draw for turn. Pass turn. Draw for turn. Okay. Do I just stick with it? I think I'm going to set one. I'm going to go to battle phase. I'm going to attack for 3k. I'm going to fiendish chain. And I have twister in response. Then I am going to book of moon. Oh, you're good. But you can't out that. You out 25? I mean, you can. You have industrial strength. I don't know how many of those you have. But also, you gotta... Dude, I don't know. That's fine. I'm gonna... Do I pass? I think I'm just gonna pass. Okay, we're gonna draw for turn. You have to have exactly industrial strength, or... Stormforth with uh, another fuel cell. Yeah. I'm going to set one. I'm going to flip summon BLS. Okay. Proceed to battle phase. Okay. BLS, attack your face down. Okay, so it flips up and I get its effect. So special summon yes. level four lower better mind for deck. Um, and you get to draw a card. Uh, the right answer is nine volt. Except nine volt doesn't nine volt miss timing. Oh, you're right. Uh, both of them do. Well, yeah, but, well, battery man triple A doesn't miss timing. He just doesn't have. He doesn't get his effect. Oh right. Oh he. Oh, yeah. I don't know who the right answer is then. Um, I'm gonna say it's. I'm gonna say it's triple A. Interesting. Um, I don't think that's the right answer. Well, either way, you destroy him. Uh, yeah, I know. Um, and that would get 9 volt out of the deck, and I already have one in the grave. So I'm going to, not hand, he's special summoning, give, give me a second. Yep, 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 uh, yep. And then, so he's special summoned in defense, and then he goes to grave, and his effect triggers, and I get to draw a card. Yep. 
And then we're going to attack your triple A, killing it. Yes. And now you are out of triple A's. Correct. I'm going to pass turn. Cool. We're going to draw for turn. Anything on standby? I got nothing on standby. Same phase one. Yep. Dark hole. Oh, you're good. <laughs> you just can't beat the best player in the game. Oh, you're... You fucking top decking bastard. <laughs> hey, I can you say the same to you. Dude, dude, I fucking uh, top pot agreed top Dude. Fucking fuck off. Uh yeah, PLS. you got it. <sighs> cool. Oh, hey, funny. I didn't even have a monster to follow that up with. <laughs> my hand was Oh really? My hand was double storm fourth and imperial order. Oh fuck, I had a hedgehog set! I could have searched out my final dragon! Okay. Alright, we're back. We're back. I don't know. Game two. Do I want to go first or do I want to go second? Do I want to go first or do I want to go second? Dude, industrial strength scares me. Oh yeah, as he should. I'm gonna go first. I'm gonna okay. go first. I'm gonna see okay. if I can somehow open the god hand and okay. Fuck your day up. Uh, that's not the god hand. <laughs> oh god, what do I do? Um. Oh, wait, no, duh. I set you, set you, oh, I forgot to choose zones. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna set two and pass. Okay. Draw for turn. Standby base? Main yep. phase one? Yep. Do not activate Stormforth right off the bat. Activate Storm. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I was gonna fucking lose my shit if you activated Stormforth right off the bat. Because Stormforth is a hell of a card. Yeah. And it's basically our only way to get kaijus <laughs> until the kaijus actually come out. Yeah. I mean, okay. we have Volcanic Queen, but it's not the same. I wish there was a better way to do this. Only one of you is one of you instead. Yeah. Well, hmm. Actually, I think that's the way to go. I'm going to normal summon nine volt. Sure You're going to normal summon nine volt. Um, what can nine volt do? He searches a card. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, I think nine volt's and fine. And his attack and defense double. Yeah. That he's popped up. Yeah. Okay. And I think the play here is <clears throat> to. But I think the play here is to grab. Triple A. Okay. I'm gonna go to battle phase. Yep. I'm going to attack your face down. Uh, destroy that. I'm knowing three. Oh, okay. So either way, he's going to the graveyard. So that's yep. Not much of much of a deal for me. <laughs> Fuck off! Oh, yay! There goes. Okay, so minus Stormforth. Okay, so you have Stormforth, which makes sense. Premature. Yep. And. Uh, BLS. Okay, that was probably the best mills I could have got. I could have. That asked was for. absolutely the worst fucking mills I could have ever asked for. Yeah, because you can't uh, special summon uh, BLS from the grave anymore. Nope. I couldn't even special summon him anyway from the grave. I'd have to first properly summon him. Right. Which is why I said anymore, or at this point, uh, I guess. Pass turn. That one. Pass. Okay. Draw for turn. Something Stand tells me you have. Yeah. Main. Yeah. Draw no, I can't do this. I think you do. I do him. I think he's the right call. Um. No, actually, I think you're the call. Seven. Okay. Yep. All right. I'm going to normal summon Mahunder. I'm gonna compulse. I'm gonna set a card and we're gonna pass. That's a card. Um, it's not a card I want to see, but it's a card. I'm gonna. Let's just hang it. 
Oh, what's better? I'd like the insert. I also, I'm just gonna set. Okay. I think I'm gonna set another one, actually. I think I'm gonna pass turn. Okay, we're gonna draw for turn. Standby? Standby okay. phase is fine. Yep. Let's try this again. Normal summon Ma Hunter? Ma Hunter's fine this time. Okay, I'm gonna use its effect, its uh, extra normal summon effect. Yep. Normal summon AAA. How many AAAs do you got in hand? One. Well, I mean, I'm special summoning. You're special I, mean, summoning I can only one. special summon one from hand. That's. I can't special summon multiple. It's one. Oh, it is one. From oh, either right. hand or grave. Dude, this card is so weird. I'm I'm like not even reading it properly. Yeah, it's when it's normal. Uh, yeah. flips face normal summon or flip fine. face up. I can special summon a battery man triple A from either hand or graveyard. Yep. Okay. We're gonna overlay for three. Yes, sir. And a what? What rank three? Do you, what rank four do you have that requires three level fours? Stellar Knight Deltaros. That is a card. Um, it is a card. Yeah, that's... That's fine. Okay. Which is unfortunate. We're going to... Pitch... Or we're going to detach a AAA to pop the back row. It does say... Okay. It doesn't say... Uh, yeah, yep. there's one it card doesn't... on the field. Yep. Sinister just... Shadow Games. Okay. Then one should call a card from deck to GY, then change any number of fates down to the hand. Okay. You didn't do that. Oh, I'm so dumb. I read that wrong. Oh, I oh, punted okay. that. I was like, you could have very easily, uh... I could have... Oh, shit. I fucked up so badly. Battle phase. We're gonna go to battle phase, and we're going to punch... We'll punch the first one you reset. All right, well, that is my Hedgehog. Hedgehog's right. effect will rock. Okay. Add me... Fusion. That's fine. The card. Yeah. Crosses on your hand or field. Turn here if your opponent repeats. Oh, fun. I can't believe I punted that. Uh, oh. We'll pass there. I punted that so fucking hard. All right, well, let's get this started right off the bat. Flip summon Squalata, pop Deltaros. Uh... Okay. It's unfortunate, but okay. That one, battle phase, attack for 18. Okay. That's... I'm gonna pass turn. Okay. I swear, if you 9-volt me, I'm gonna be fucking livid. Well, I guess you're gonna be livid because I activate Battery Charger. <laughs> if I have ah! Yeah. Okay. Trigger 9-volt? Breakthrough. Fine. Party 9-volt. Fine. You don't get your fun. Um... You could still easily drop industrial strength on me, and I don't have it out to it right now. I'm gonna tribute nine volt to normal summon to to summon charger. Trigger charger. Fuck. Oh my god. Fuck. You're so good at this damn game. Fuck you. <laughs> Draw your fucking, search your fucking card, or uh, special summon your fucking monster. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Okay. Question is, uh, if I summon nine volt, you get nine am volts I allowed to activate again. his effect? You get nine volts effect again. Because yeah. okay, because it says uh, you can only use this effect once per turn. Yeah, but I negated the, I negated it. Oh, okay. 
Okay. And again, if we're wrong, I'm sure someone will point it out in the comments. Mm -hmm. uh, special nine volt from deck. Yeah. Uh, then I guess technically I have to do that, and then nine volts effect. Yep. Add industrial strength. Oh. Add one battery man. Yeah. And then I'm going to pitch, and then I'm going to banish. I'd banish a nine volt and a triple. A. Yeah. I'd banish nine volt and triple. Nine a. volt and a triple A. Yeah. To special. Oh, you still have one that's live. Yeah, it's a special summon industrial strength. Oh my god, I'm so good at this damn game. <laughs> Go to battle phase. I Nine volt, you. which is at two thousand, is going to punch into. Yep. Or two hundred. Uh, the battery man charger attacks directly for. Uh, twenty-four. Twenty. What? Oh right, it's nine hundred. Uh, yeah, yeah twenty-seven it's for each, not every other. Put the both. Yeah, so twenty-seven, and then attack, and then industrial strength punches in for twenty-six. All right. At the end phase, 9 volt goes to grave, and I pass turn. Dude. That would have been so good one turn earlier. That would have been so good one turn earlier. I'm going to set one and pass. Mm. All right, we're going to draw for turn. Standby. We're good. All right, main phase one. Hmm. I think we're just going to go to battle phase and you got it. attack the game. Okay. So, okay. Oh thank God. Dude, my I hand was, got was, clogged like, with Stormforce after oh, yeah, that. That's my my hand got clogged with Stormforce at the beginning at in last so, game. Except I still. Won. The reason I was so pissed. Yeah. I had JD in my hand the entire time. Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. During game one. During game one, I had him in my hand the entire time. Uh, I didn't even, like, think about it. Also, Ben, guess what? I pulled Castell, too! Oh. So as yeah, if no. my rank 4 pool could get even better! Yeah, I did not pull Castell. Yeah, my rank 4 pool is busted. I'm still opening 29 packs. Yep. <laughs> I'm still oh, winning. dude. See, I dude. had Chaos Trap Hole just in case you could summon anything. <laughs> I was like, yeah, it's not happening. I'm so Dude, it's just, I can't win. I don't know what it is. I can't win. All right. Here we are for the wheel. What are we going to pull? I really hope I pull something. I get one of the, maybe tournament packs would be the right play. I don't know. Uh, but it looks like tournament packs it is. I don't know what set we're on, but we're going to find out. We are still on Astral Pack 5, which means we get another shot at Yamamoto and Gagaga -Ga -Ga Cowboy and whatnot. So let's see what we can pull. We got Charger Light Brigade and another fucking Book of Moon. What else? Mm, this is not the cards I want to see. Well, we got three more. We got three more. Again, not what I want to see. Two more. We got two more. God damn it. Okay. Final, final pack. Probably not getting anything. That is a soul exchange. I did not realize that was in that set. We got a soul exchange now, so I can add that to Battery Man. Though I don't think I'm going to because the three Stormforth and... With only four targets, um, not the best. And another charge of the fucking like brigade. All in all, soul exchange is the only highlight, but I don't think I'm gonna use it. So, fun. All right, well we're gonna add collection and we're gonna wrap up the video here. So I'm gonna say, if you all enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you feel like it. Of course you don't want to, but it'd be greatly appreciated. In the next episode, new challengers. Uh, I don't know what's in that set. We're gonna find out in the before the next episode, and we're gonna talk about it before we start the opening. What I hope to pull. I know one thing that I hope to pull. What's his name? Rebellion, Dark Rebellion. So yeah. All right. Until next time, this is Fresco, signing out.